Hi, welcome to Arm Wraps. My name is Randy Miller, and today I'm going to be showing you how I install an external door wrap on a metal door. So this is run as a, a custom print, and uh, here we go. So the first thing I do is I remove the door handles, and then the next thing I do is I clean it really good with rubbing alcohol and water, just get it all nice and smooth and clean. And what you're seeing right here is I designed a squeegee that if you follow the arrows, I'm going to show you real quickly what the arrows are for and uh, you get a lot less air bubbles if you follow the arrows. Next is I cut the backing with one inch strip, just the backing alone, and what I call tack it in on. So I'm going to tack it on real quick. We're going to remove that strip right there, and then I'm going to reposition it until I know I'm happy with it. And then I'm going to pull the top part off, the, and then uh, tack it in on on the top part. Now what I'm going to be showing you is I'm going to put my foot down and I'm stretching the vinyl out and then I'm doing is I'm following the arrows when I'm installing it and this is what I'm showing you with the arrows now if you note um, it was a hot day it was about 82 degrees and the sun was hitting it so the vinyl does stretch so what I'm doing is I'm using my foot my left foot down and I'm pushing it down so you can see how taut it, it gets so it's just easier for me to install it. I would recommend waiting for uh, in the morning time when the sun's not beating on it and it's not really a hot day to install this and uh, you have a lot less troubles but um, yeah you can kind of see how, how I did that. So if you want a custom print like this, you can go to our maps.com website and if you don't see what you're looking for, we can custom design something for you. Uh, just email me at rmraps at gmail.com and then uh, tell me what you're looking for and then uh, we can kind of design it for you. Or if you have your own design, you can send in design and everything and kind of go from there. Usually it's not that hard to do on, on a normal kind of day, uh, but like again, I would recommend doing on a cooler time time of day and the sun's not hitting it so but you can see it's doable all right thank you for watching if you got any comments or questions comment down below and uh, email me rmraps at gmail.com check out my website rmraps.com and you can always call me 208-696-1180 thanks hi right, welcome to rmraps my name is Randy Miller and this is the second uh, print that I did the first print lasts about eight years and that was a little too long and it was kind of hard to get off so i recommend if you're doing an outdoor print like this do four to five years and then you got to remove it if not you're going to be scraping it off the door but i did this uh a little while ago the design and everything uh but i'll show uh up, up top right hand corner show links how do i how i installed this and everything it's an air release final matte sheen so i did this door that's a 36 inch door, and this is actually a 48 inch door right over here. I just, now it's just re, uh, reapplied this right here, and I'll send another video as so go top right hand corner, click on that, and I'll show you how you, I, I wrap this right here. So if you want something like that, just make sure the door is flat. Metal is the best subject to wrap it on. And um, if it's be hitting in the sun, like over there, like every day, all day, uh, max four or five years. This, this actually lasts a little longer than that, but uh, we just replace it and everything. So I just add a little humor to this guy in right here. So if you want some custom design like this, or or if you see some designs you see on my website, rmraps.com website, uh, yeah, order there, or let me know what you uh, want to see on your doors. All right, thanks for watching. If you got any comments or questions, comment down below. Email me at rmraps at gmail.com. Also, um, you can always call me, 208-696-1180. All right, have a great day. Thanks.